Kranich and crew, it's good to be with you again. And today I want to just uh, let you know that I'm actually making a series of Udemy courses and the video that follows this is a part of that. So as you are one of my YouTube subscribers, you get the whole course free right here on our YouTube channel. So stay tuned, subscribe, like, and hit the bell. So hitting the bell is very important by the way because if you hit the bell, you'll be notified of every video as and when they're published. So do that and I will see you tomorrow. Take care of yourself, okay, bye for now. Hello and welcome back to the course. In this video, we are continuing our look at HyperEdit. In the last video of the course, we studied the download gates. Today, we are going to be looking at link gates. So let's go to link gates here. As you see, I haven't actually made any yet, but all my focus has been on the download gates. So most people who use HyperEdit don't use any of these other ones. They use download gates. But let's try this now. So let's go to share music and click on link gate. Let's find the products. Okay, so we need to type in here our artist's name. Type in here the name of the products, which is Insta Series Bundle by WA Production. We need to click on next secret link so we have our secret link now we need to paste it in here this is our affiliate code for the products and now next and the button text and the button text um, so we put download next design so we need to go back to our um, plugin boutique or page this is the page okay so then we go back to hype edit so we have to do our cover art now and we need a square 500 by 500 we have got an image already I'll show you in a second so it's over here this one here originally we had this image here which is a rectangle which is the wrong shape for what we need so we needed to get a square and for this I'll show you the program that we use we use resize image.net and it looks like this so this is our original image you go to you have to upload it up here then change it here and put in the dimensions you need down here so we've got 600 by 600 then you need to download it here and change uh, process it here and download it here so that's how to change the, the image from a rectangle to a square so let's continue we need to upload the square now we have a choice the same choice as we had in the download gate where we have the dark screen the custom screen the light screen or whatever um, we, we can keep or remove the HyperEdit logo. I think we'll keep it, but we'll go to custom again. And we'll type, we'll put in a nice green to go with the image. I'll do. Okay. So the button now, we'll make that light green. Not, not too light, maybe. Maybe just there. That'll be fine. And then the text at the top, we need to make that white. So that's fine, stands out well enough, so that's fine. So let's go to next, and then we have we can choose all of the same gate steps that we had for our download gate. So we'll have Facebook, share post, and like page. Let's get our link for our Facebook page, our Facebook page link, copy, cut, and paste here. There we have it. That's all fine. Went to public. Yeah. 
email promotion we'll choose into the night and next Facebook pixel we don't have that but you can have that so this is not eligible for the top 100 list and it's, it's not eligible for, for I've had it chart so let's click create and now it's ready so that's woohoo your link gate is now ready so thank you for joining me and in the next video we will be looking at how to sh how to share your link gate on your Facebook page and through all your social media um, accounts